Hey kids, it's me, Tony. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel if you've never been here before. So, I know it's been a hot minute since I've um, done a video other than those kind of ASMR things. But I just have had no time. So, I thought I would do something a little different. And uh, as you can see, I'm in my infamous bathroom. Although I am not sitting on the floor like Trisha Paytas or um, Charles Gross. I am sitting in a chair like a grown-up. And I thought I would do a get ready with me sort of basic uh, what I do every day uh, makeup for work. You know, not the most exciting thing in the world, but it's something different. Because, I mean, this is, you don't usually see me with a lot of makeup. <sighs> Just because I'm usually, when I'm, you know, it's like I've been working from home and then I do a video afterwards or something like that. So, I thought I'd let you see. And since I'm in a hurry in the morning, <laughs> I'm not going to actually do it like, you know, on a Tuesday morning or something. So, I'm actually doing it on a Saturday night. So this is my face. This is the face of a 61 and a half year old. Yes, I have a zit right there. Please notice the zit. I don't know if you can tell. I have sort of larger pores, little lines and wrinkles, all that stuff. So here's what I do, okay? Uh, first of all, my face is all clean, all clean. And uh, right now what I've been doing is I've been using this Aven, Aven, uh, it's a thermal spring water. And just to kind of, you know, when you get older, your skin's drier. So I usually just spritz my face a little bit with that. And then, if I can find it, I have this Retin oil. That's a repair oil. And I will put just a little bit, and I put it on my hand. I will pat it onto my face and just sort of, um, it's supposed to help with scarring and just with, you know, sort of a retin-ish type of topical. It's not real oily and it kind of traps in the moisture. That's what I've told myself. So that's it as far as, you know, a lot of prep. Um, I have been trying, where is it, this Nivea Firming Goodbye Cellulite with Q10 Plus, not for cellulite, but around my eyes. Um, it's been recommended different people on YouTube, and actually I couldn't find it in the store. And if you look online, it's very expensive. So I actually got mine from Europe somewhere. So I just put it around my eyes. But that's really all the prep I do. Now, I've said this before, but I hate foundation for the most part because as you get old, you have kind of creepy, you can see I kind of have a creepy skin. And what happens is when you put makeup foundation on that, it just settles in and it says, hi. I'm Tony's creepy skin. So I don't like to do that, so I do use a primer. Right now I'm using this No Pore Blem Primer by, what is this? Touch in Soul. And I think I got this in a subscription box. I think it was in a boxy charm. Now here's what I do. Again, I use my hand. As I put my little squirt of stuff, can you see it go? Okay. And then this is my ordinary coverage, what does this say? Foundation. Like I said, I don't really like to use it, but what I'll do is just put the tiniest bit on my hand. I'm an idiot. Okay, so you see that? But when you mix it together, it looks like foundation. 
that's what I do. And then I don't need no stinking brush. Maybe a brush would be better, but usually in the morning I don't want to fuss with a brush just for foundation. For this, I will pat it into my skin. to get it around my eyes down here all places where I have a little crevices and really that's all I do now this will kind of dry up and it just I don't know if you can really tell I try to make the light better in here but it gives me just enough coverage that it still looks smooth and it doesn't look crepey. And I feel like I can go out in public. So then, uh, the next thing I do, and I think I got this out of a BoxyCharm, it's the Pretty Vulgar Make Them Blush Blush. And this is in Cream Vixen, I guess. It's mostly a really like fuchsia pink, and um, so this is it. I know it's like screaming pink, so I do not use a lot. I this is for blush. That's that's all I do. Is I press it down, and then. A little bit here, a little bit there. That's it. Let me check it. I have a regular mirror. Okay. And that that's pretty much it. But the last thing, and I've done different things. I've done finishing powders. But my favorite is the Hourglass ethereal glow ambient light which let me tell you does not come cheap but I like it I think some people use it as a highlighter or as a blush and but I use it as pretty much an overall um, finishing powder it's very light and I just press everything in That's really all I do. Now, um, as you can tell, I have no eyebrows. So I have to pretty well put them in. So, I use various things, but usually just for work. Because again, I'm in a hurry. This is a just a eyebrow pencil. And... Trying to do this where you can see it. So while I'm doing this, let me tell you. My little doggy has dementia. And it's sad, like a person. He started acting kind of funny the last month or so. We took him in, and the doctor said, yep, he has doggy dementia. Which means he runs around, he walks around in circles, he wanders, he gets stuck, because he goes in between things. I don't think he knows who we are, except that I feed him. Uh, he's a great appetite. He still goes outside to pee. 
but he'll walk and walk and walk and walk and walk and walk for an hour and then he'll just collapse because he's so tired, poor baby. So I'm not sure how long that's gonna last. But, um, oh, the other thing I do when I have time is I do have one of these jade rollers that I try to use for no other reason it feels good. Okay, so, you know, their eyebrows. Then I do eyeshadow and for today's purposes, I will use this really old Mally. Um, because it's got some, I, I'm going to do something for work. I don't need anything crazy. There is no Jeffree Star at work, okay? And, um, I like it because it has a pretty nice double-ended, um, brush in it. And it does have a pretty good, um, base color. And so, I'm not going to do anything fancy. And I will put in, you know, a little bit of a taupe color in the in the crease to give it a little depth. Then, if I'm feeling fancy, a little bit of gold. That's so when you have squinty eyes like mine, you to do something. So that's that part. This is really fast, okay? Part of the reason is because my battery's about to die. Um, then, Again, for sake of time, I don't try to do a big liner per se. What I do is I just have a little makeup forever pencil and I just go along my waterline. I don't try to get fancy. This is work. see it okay that's all I do if I'm gonna go out or something we'll do that another day <laughs> well, my battery's not gonna die and then just mascara this is the better than sex what is it Too Faced mascara although my favorite is um, really um, Laura Geller Glam Lash but this this is okay. Again, this is like I'm just trying to get out the door. Kind of thing and then the last thing um, for every day lipstick I have this Clinique chubby stick in strawberry which pretty much matches my lip tone Jeffree Star and just put a 
a little lighter color because I have really thin lips. And kids, that's it. This is the walk out the door Tony every day. It's not fancy. It is um, where you can see my face. So, um, hope this wasn't like totally boring. And um, if you like stuff like that, let me know. If you like the video, let me know. If you didn't like the video, let me know. If you stumbled on here, please uh, think about joining my channel, subscribing, and uh, hit the like button and hit the little bell, and you'll know, as I always say, I um, upload uh, videos when I have something to talk about or something to do like this. So, that's it for tonight. Y'all have a great Saturday night. You can see how I've spent my Saturday night. Isn't that exciting? Me and the hubby and the dog with dementia. Yeah, I have an exciting, exciting life. Don't you want to know more? Anyway, that's it. Y'all have a good night. See you later. Bye-bye.